Hi, this is Corey from PodGadget.com. We'll be reviewing the Trillion app from Cerulean Studios today. So let's jump right into it. So you turn it on and you see your Astra login. So we're going to go ahead and click on that. Um, Trillion has been pretty much requiring people to use a Astra login to have all their AIM accounts and Yahoo accounts all in one place for them, for their convenience. Um, so, you can see the first thing that shows up is your contact list, and there's me. <laughs> so, usually you'll have all your AIM, your Yahoo, so forth, you know, you got a search bar, look through them all. Uh, let's go to the next thing, you have favorites, I don't have any favorites. Um, and then your chat log, and we'll get to that actually, let's open that up. So this is what a chat menu actually looks like, and I'm going to go ahead and send myself a message. And there it is, me talking to myself. Uh, we can go ahead and reply back. And it's just like the original Trillion desktop application, all the same sounds and so forth. Let me go back. So this is what it looks like in the chat log. And then we have accounts on the end. Um, so you can set your status, the online, away, vis invisible, um, you can mess with some of the settings in here. Uh, you can change your display name. I guess that's not really important. Um, what message you want to put for when you're away. And then finally, the accounts you have under this Astro login. Uh, so I can show you what is supported. You click the little plus button, click type. And you can see we have AIM, Facebook, Google, ICQ, Jabber, MySpace, and Windows, and Yahoo all pretty much standard logins for uh, people that are doing chat uh, instant messenger uh, chatting and so it's pretty much basic information you know you want to add in and stuff like that um, some other stuff that is not in the app itself you can go to settings if it'll load scroll down a little bit a trillion and then you can turn on avatars, you can turn them off. Uh, let's turn it off and I'll show you what it looks like. Um, you can hide your offline contacts, you can show them, you can group them together. Uh, you can sort your contacts in a special way, there's only two ways. Um, turning on landscape, you can turn on autocorrect if you want. Uh, what else? You got sounds, you got vibrate. Pretty much a lot of settings that are normal to uh, a mobile. Uh, instant messaging program basically what is what is uh, expected so we're going to go back and check out that change again so when you close it and then you open back up it'll start resuming from what you were uh, originally logged into in Astra and so you can see the, the avatar is gone that I changed if you want to switch accounts you, you can have up you can have multiple Astra accounts on this this app so if you wanted to switch, you just click sign out. It would sign you out just as you were logging in. You can add a new account. So you can even register for an account from here also. So um, if you have any more questions or any comments, anything you want to know specifically about this app or any other apps you want me to review, just go ahead and leave it in the comments section or drop me a line in the about section on podgadget.com. So this has been Corey from podgadget.com. Thanks.